hello friend welcome back in our previous video we successfully load our font in team and they have some of the images missing because i have i didn't update that images right so that is all that is static images uh, here right now i want to do to segment our mm, main part from with the header and also want to segment that as a footer because that will actually the common part for our every pages so if you want to segment it our posture will be same in our main master I have already carried our um, EL part. So that is our header. Header is started. I want to do to take that header. You can see there is our header. I simply cut it header. And now in our header plate, that is in our font in body. And then the header here, I paste it. And now we have to do, we have to simply include, right? Now I want to do and to include. So that will be include. So that will be include. And include will be our wish space. That will be in our font in font in and then the body and then the header right so that will be the font in body header and also I want to take that our footer part so that is our footer footer is started footer is ended I simply cut that footer and now in our footer blade here I paste it and then our process will be same I want to do to include I simply included our footer so that is in our font in body and then the footer Okay, then that will be loaded our footer part. Now I simply segment it. Now our main blade is very clean. Okay, our main blade is clean. Click the save all. Everything should be the same. If you now refresh it. Yeah, you can see our header is successfully loaded. Our menu is successfully loaded and also our footer. Great. And as I told you friend, they have some of the images missing. Like right now that part I have already taken it in our main. That means in our index and into this index, uh, they have some of the images. You can see there are some of the images as a banner image. I want to done to update. So I simply copy it. So that so I will actually make it total dynamic. So right now we don't need to actually update it manually one by one. I simply show you that is actually our one of the image. I simply update. Now click as a save all. Now the, in our theme, you can see there are one of the image. Now that image should be display. Click as a refresh. Yeah, you can see images display. Great. So friend, in our, from our next video, and right now our admin panel is ready, our font in theme is also ready, right? Right now we don't need this, I close it. So if from our next video, I want to do, I want to make our all that part, like in our font in, they have one of the title, they have one of the short description, that is on the images, and also they have one of the video link, right? So every part I want to do, I want to make it as a dynamic. Okay, so we'll actually manage everything from our database. So how can do this work step by step as I told you friend everything will be very much clear to you. So how can do this work in our next video I will show you that things with the live example. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.